boy band Take That will be one of the music acts performing to celebrate the coronation of Prince Charles in May this year, but an essential member will be missing. The band, who rose to fame in the 1990s, originally had five members but have now been whittled down to just three. However, Jason Orange is reportedly in talks to rejoin his bandmates for the Royal Bash after he left the pop group in 2014. Jason could be set to rejoin bandmates Gary Barlow, Mark Owen and Howard Donald to perform for the new King, Queen consort Camilla and millions of TV viewers for the concert from the Gardens of Windsor Castle. However, original member Robbie Williams, who left the band in 1995, has reportedly ruled out appearing with his former bandmates. The band originally formed in 1990 and went on to have huge hits with 12 number one records across four decades, selling 45 million records around the world. After a break of nearly 10 years, Take That members Gary Barlow, Howard Donald, Mark Owen and Jason Orange reformed in 2005. Yet the band split again when Jason left in 2014, leaving just three members left. Take That were one of the first names mentioned for the royal celebrations when Charles takes the throne officially on May 6, after Gary Barlow was called in to help with the celebrations for the Queen's Diamond Jubilee concert in 2012. Take That are touring the UK on one of their biggest tours yet this summer as well as visiting Finland and Denmark, but here mark the May weekend in case they got the nod from organizers to perform for the royal family. A source said, the biggest names and acts in world music are being approached for the concert. If you draw up a list of the most popular acts in the world over the past 30 years then they are all being considered. But take that we're right near the top of that list and are a massive coup for the organizers to get over the line so early. Other music icons expected to join the lineup include Aussie singer Kylie Minogue and US star Lionel Richie.